All right. Made it to a new camp spot. Uh, found this last night. Got up early yesterday morning. It was raining a little bit. Decided it would be a good day to get my oil changed, tires rotated. Uh, I had to do it this week before I made my next move anyway. So drove into town, got groceries. It took the entire day. I left at like 8 in the morning. By the time I got into town, it was like 12, 12.30. And then it was around 3 before they were done. Uh, and then drove back. I got here at like 8 o'clock. But really cool camp spot. So I went ahead and set up my tarp. Definitely gonna fish here today. Might relocate up and down the stream a little bit in my truck uh, rather than, cause the road pretty much stays with the, the creek. Um, and just jump in a couple spots, take it easy. Think I need to plan what I'm gonna do next. I'm not really sure. The smoke here is pretty good. Some of the other areas that I was planning on going were bad. I went and checked the air quality for Idaho, called a couple buddies in Montana and they said the same thing. Uh, just not really anywhere to go right now where you're not gonna be breathing in forest fire smoke and just you know in it all day long and then sleeping at night super excited right now because i can actually see clouds i haven't seen clouds or a blue sky in about a week so kind of nice to see that so from here i don't know we'll go figure it out i got a few more weeks i wanted to be on the road uh but i haven't really planned out what i was going to do next so i don't know i just gotta figure it out when i go but uh today just hang out here fish this stream and then maybe check on a couple more in this area kind of thought about throwing some streamers for some bull trout but i'm just not sure if they're done spawning yet it's the you know september uh i, I just didn't do a lot of research when i come out here i don't come out here for the fish i come out here for the just the just the, the experience you know just getting away from it all and getting in the mountains and these blue these you know blue lines on maps and a lot of times you know i don't really check and see if it's going to be brown trout or rainbows or bull trout or cutthroat i just go to the area and fish it and just have a good time so but i do know there are bull trout here uh, i caught one last year on a uh, a small streamer so might just go back to that stream and throw a bigger streamer I'm gonna make some lunch uh put my wet clothes on they haven't quite dried the temperature for the next couple of days today's good It'll be great wet weight uh, weather it's gonna be up in the 70s uh, and then it's gonna drop to about 50 tonight and then there's a front coming through i guess because the next couple days into next week, a little bit of rain, a little bit of freezing rain. The highs are in the 50s. The lows, at some days I saw like 20, 25. So uh, the entire situation might change. It might be, turn into wader season real quick. And for me, that means transitioning to some bigger water. Uh, probably go to some place where I can camp, set up camp for a long time, gather some firewood. Hopefully I'll have to check the fire restrictions. I'm not really sure what they are. I haven't built a fire. Um, and then set up a like a more of a, a base camp and on some bigger water and fish in waders and places you can drive in and hike and uh not necessarily small streams and hiking into spots but we'll just see how that goes later today is another another day today's a fishing day so i'm ready to go i didn't get to fish at all yesterday and one of my things when i'm on this road trip is i like to at least put a bug in the water every day and i didn't get to do that yesterday so I'm ready to go. It's going to be a good day though. Make some lunch first.
So I got another so there's a fly I'm using today. Just a uh, basically a guy's choice here is here. Nothing fancy. I got a number six split shot above it just to help it get down a little bit. Come here, little fish. Giant white fish. Good and gracious. here somebody 
came by camp earlier and left some beer for me. All right, that is, uh, I'm pretty much done for the day. Uh, I'm tired. Hung out with uh, a couple that uh, recognized me from YouTube, said that uh, they liked my videos. So that was kind of cool. Always fun whenever you rec when somebody recognizes you and you get to hang out and talk and they appreciate the videos. That's, kinda, that's just, just, uh, just makes it really nice. You know, I hadn't seen anybody or talked to anybody for seven weeks and then you have a cool conversation with a uh, couple. But uh, anyway, uh, end of the day, had a bull trout swipe at one of the little tiny cutthroats, so that was cool. Um, got me excited, maybe throw some streamers later. Uh, what else? That's pretty much it. Um, make sure you check the description for a uh, playlist for this road trip. Um, should be uh, weeks and weeks and weeks and weeks. I'm on going on week seven now of videos to catch up on if you're just now getting here. Uh, other than that, yep, gonna camp out here, do dinner, get off my feet, rest. The temperatures, man, they're getting. It's getting cold. It's already like down into the 50s already. Um, and it rained a little bit today, so you can tell the, the seasons are changing. Gonna be interesting. Also gonna be fun. But uh, that's pretty much all I got for tonight. Appreciate you watching the video. We'll get back on here again tomorrow.